Everything wasn't in a nostalgia. The removable battery in the Nokia simply should definitely bring back some memories. The entire back shell is a single piece of plastic which comes off so you can install the battery, SIM cards and a micro SD card. Now, there are two slots for nano SIM cards so you won't need any adapters. It's not too thick at 8.69mm and weighs a comfortable 184 grams. The Nokia C3 looks elegant thanks to the minimalistic back which only has a tiny vertical camera module and a fingerprint sensor. The volume and power buttons are to the right while the dedicated Google Assistant button is placed on the left. And there's a headphone jack on the top and a micro USB port at the bottom. Coming to the front of the phone, there's a 5.99 inch HD plus IPS display with toughened glass. The Nokia C3 is powered by a Unisoft processor and the one I'm testing has 3GB of RAM and 32GB of storage but you can also get the base variant which comes with 2GB of RAM and 16GB of storage. And the phone supports an FM radio too but it requires a headset to be connected in order to work. Also, because it doesn't have a gyroscope and compass, you won't be able to see the direction you're facing in apps like Google Maps. Nokia C3 runs stock Android 10 with just the basic apps from Google pre-installed. The Google Assistant button should be handy if you're an avid user of it. The Nokia C3 has a single 8 megapixel rear camera and a 5 megapixel selfie camera.